the countless, you know, therapists and specialists and trainers and this and the other, we all had to revolve around. Has Dwayne Wade and Gabrielle Union gone their separate ways? It's starting to seem more and more obvious that the power couple have called it quits. You know, I'm struggling, I'm struggling. I see him walk by and I'm like, oh, yo, can you, can you get me a glass of water, please? And he goes, I don't work for you. You'll never believe what these two are hiding and how similar it is to Will and Jada. The rumors first emerged last month after a report from a popular online outlet claimed that Dwayne and Gabrielle were living separately. Neither Dwayne nor Gabrielle have publicly confirmed if what we've been hearing is true, leaving room for others to fill in the gaps about the relationship. But the fact is that the last time either one of them posted about the other on social media was a while ago. That was on October 15th when they celebrated their ninth anniversary anniversary as a couple. However, a couple of cryptic posts have helped to fuel the fire of speculation about their marriage. The first of these was shared by Gabrielle. The actress shared a photo of herself on Instagram with a concerning caption. She wrote, when they ask you to smile for the camera, but you're really thinking about how to get out of this mess. It wasn't long before Dwayne posted what many started to think might have been a response to Gabrielle's hint at her unhappiness. He shared a video of him himself on Twitter with a caption of his own and what he wrote did nothing to put fans of the couple at ease. He wrote that sometimes you've got to let go of what you love to find yourself again. It all sounded pretty worrying. Away from social media, neither have had anything bad to say about each other in any recent interviews. This has led some to the conclusion that the rumors about them were baseless, but there has been plenty of controversy throughout the star's roller coaster of a relationship over the years, and they have not been shy about airing their dirty laundry in public. In her memoir, You Got Anything Stronger, Gabrielle shared some shocking details about Dwayne in the years before their marriage. She revealed that Dwayne had actually cheated on her with another woman in 2013, and even more shockingly, the affair led to the birth of a child. Gabrielle wrote in her book that it went without saying that they were not in a good place in their relationship at the time. They had been struggling to make time in their hectic schedules to be really present for each other as partners. However, they were in a better place a few months later, and this was the moment Dwayne decided to tell her about the pregnancy. The news shattered Gabrielle. As she put it, to say that she was devastated would be to pick a word from a low shelf for convenience. She explained why it took her so long to get around to talking about something that had happened more than eight years earlier. It turned out that eight years was how long it took for her to find the words to even try to properly discuss the ordeal. And even then, after untold amounts of therapy, she still wasn't sure that she had the right words. However, she also wrote that she knew that the truth mattered, but some have speculated that she took so long to reveal this information for a different reason and that was actually holding on to the secret until such a time that she wanted to hurt Dwayne's reputation. Whatever the truth was, their relationship survived the scandal. For a while, this must have looked pretty unlikely due to how badly Dwayne had hurt Gabrielle. The year that he cheated on her was actually the same year that they got engaged. They'd already been together for five years at that point, but another reason it affected her so much was more personal. Gabrielle had struggled all her life with worries about infertility. She wanted a baby for a long time and had even tried to have one with Dwayne previously. Reflecting on the up and down history of the relationship, Gabrielle made a shocking admission. She said that if she had to do it all over again, she probably would not have forgiven Dwayne for cheating on her. She wrote that she was glad that she decided to stay for one reason. The hard work it took to get back together, stay together, and eventually get married forced them to work on themselves. They managed to improve as a couple and as individuals. Gabrielle saw this as proof that she wouldn't be the person she is today without doing all that work. However, this came at a personal cost. Gabrielle also said that the person that she is today wouldn't have stuck with Dwayne after discovering what he'd done. In fact, she still thought about how different things might have been. She wrote about hearing a small voice in her heart when she found out about his actions. The voice had told her to leave Dwayne, but she didn't want to go through the public humiliation that would follow when the truth came out. After admitting something like that, what are we supposed to think about their marriage? Is it even real? If the recent rumors are true, it could be that their marriage has only been kept together for appearances for longer than we thought. On top of all their messy history, 
Recent gossip has claimed that Dwayne has once again been unfaithful to his wife. The online gossip page Dumois stated that the NBA legend has been seen in the company of another woman in a so-called intimate setting. This is only added to speculation that Dwayne and Gabrielle have been operating a kind of Will and Jada Smith marriage for a while. There have been plenty of theories about hidden secrets in the Wade marriage for years, and some of them have been pretty crazy. The rumors are that Dwayne might actually be hosting some wild parties with people that you might not expect. The story goes that Dwayne has a little bit of a reputation for hosting some insane parties. These are allegedly secret parties where Dwayne can get close to other famous men, including rappers, if you know what I mean. Obviously, this is some pretty surprising news about Dwayne, but more recently, it was actually Gabrielle who came under the spotlight. She was accused of being a big part of Dwayne's late night entertainment. And this year, she finally addressed the rumor that she was in joint charge of parties for closeted Hollywood men. But the rumor itself has actually been around for a lot longer. In fact, it started over a decade ago. Back in 2010, someone close to Dwayne spilled the tea about Dwayne's alleged crazy lifestyle. Richard Von Houtman was Dwayne's former business partner before things turned sour. After they fell out, Richard claimed that while still married to his first wife, Dwayne was known to throw the craziest parties. According to Richard, the parties were often fueled by illegal substances. Richard described Dwayne's home as a four-bedroom place on the first floor of a high-rise, which sounded like a slightly odd place for a famous NBA player to live. However, it's likely that this was just one of several houses owned by Dwayne. And it's even possible that he had this house just for the purpose of having his alleged secret parties away from his wife. This sounded even more likely when Richard claimed that he used to be in charge of a cleaning crew which regularly worked at the house. One day, Richard got a call from his crew and apparently they were appalled by what they had found. Richard went down to investigate. He described what he saw as disgusting. He said the place was trash and filthy. Annie added that this was not the first time this has happened. He went on to describe some of the things he saw as well as empty bottles. There was also allegedly half-eaten food substances and used protection everywhere. Allegedly, these kinds of parties would take place several times a week. Around this time, Dwayne was also going through an ugly divorce from his first wife, Savan Funches. During their divorce battle, Savan made more alarming accusations that put Dwayne's public image into question, and some of the things she said were shocking. Savan claimed that in 2007, Dwayne gave her an STD. According to Richard, this was around the time when Dwayne's secret party started becoming a regular thing. Once again, Dwayne's go-to tactic was to attack and shut down. He sued his ex-wife for defamation of character, so it's clear that Dwayne's image and reputation in the public eye has always meant a lot to him. Could this be another clue that he and Gabrielle are putting on a front about their marriage? Only time will tell if the most recent rumors of the end of their relationship have any truth to them. But what do you guys think? Is Dwayne and Gabrielle's marriage just a lie? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below.